I, Fiona Dawson, and bisexual. Gay. Gay. <laughs> bisexual. 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 I'm gay. Well, before I came out, I feel I felt like something was missing. You know, I just felt like I wanted to be part of something that wasn't part of the straight community in a way. And I knew that I was a bit different from everybody else, but I just couldn't quite place it. My everyday life before I came out was, yeah, it was just like a normal person in a way, just hung out with my friends whenever I could. And it's kind of interesting because you know you have that one solid group of friends where they all start out as straight and then everybody slowly becomes gay and then you have that one straight friend. That was pretty much it. After coming out, I felt like a source of relief in a way. Like I felt like I had nothing to really hide from anymore. I just wanted to tell my close friends and family and that's what I did. My uh, attitude towards um, after coming out was just like, okay, you know what? If this is going to be me, this is going to be me. And um, definitely fashion sense. Before I came out, I felt just not myself. It was very much like, I was holding a big part of me back, and I am still not fully out to my family, but only parts. And it's still, I still have a lot to accomplish, but it's getting easier. Well, I've mostly come up to friends and family. My friends have been all, have not encountered any friends who have told me anything bad or like said, oh, I don't accept you the way you are or anything like that. Family, younger generation is more accepting. Older generation has been very much like, oh, your bisexuality is a phase. It's not real. Um, and my grandmother turned to God and prayed away. And, yeah. I, an example of a change would probably be my father, he was very much like, I am raising an Armenian son who's going to have an Armenian wife, who's going to have Armenian children. And as I came out to him, I just saw, saw his like, whole vision of my life just shattered before him. And he just started contemplating, like, what can I do to fix this? And that showed me, like, oh, he's not really trying to accept me for who I am. He's trying to figure out a way to fix this problem. I believe that the public has taken amazing steps towards acceptance of the LGBTQ community. Especially in the past like two years, I've seen, especially in my high school class, about like half of the people came out after graduation and it just surprised everyone. They're like, oh, these are the people I grew up with my entire life. They're no different than me. And it was just like, what are we, like more, people were more questioning what are we trying to stop? Like, these are our friends that we knew our entire life. There's no reason to try to stop this. In the community, I believe more progress could be made by more education to people who are completely against homosexuality in any form. Just being like, hey, it's, I don't follow your religion. Don't push it on me. <laughs> don't push the rules on me. Uh, just accept me for who I am. I'm a human being that deserves equal rights as you do. I'm not harming you in any way with my homosexuality. 